All right, guys and gals, we're going to try to make this short and sweet. It's just going to be me talking. Um, you guys haven't seen a video, uh, uh, you know, from me in the past couple weeks. Um, if you didn't catch my live, you don't know why. My live was last week, and so if you didn't catch that, you really don't know why. I didn't publish it out, uh, you know, to be seen by everything, everybody. It was just, you know, just a live chat or whatever. But uh, anyway... Um, couple things I wanted to touch base on. First thing is if you guys are ready to get into hot shotting or the trucking world, flat bedding, whatever it is, whether it's semi truck, pickup truck, medium duty truck, whatever. Now is the time to get all your poop in a pile. Make sure all your ducks are in a row and get that paperwork done and get out on the road as soon as possible. Uh, I look for this to really take off. Uh, here at the end of the first quarter, we're approaching that pretty quick. We're already into March now. Uh, so you have just a little less than a month. Um, you know, make it happen. You don't want to start in June or July or, or anything like that or later. If now is the time to start uh, as far as flatbed freight goes. Um, and that goes for the pickup trucks, the semi trucks. It doesn't matter. Anything in between. Um, as far as the flat bedding goes, you guys are wanting to start right now and get every penny that you can get during prime time season. That prime time is anywhere from mid March all the way until, uh, I would say end of September into the first of November is that little bit of, uh, uh, gap there when it starts slowing back down for the winter time. So now's you know, now's the best time to do it if you're going to do it. Uh, so if you're ready to pull the trigger, I would suggest go ahead and do it. The only thing that I suggest that you do along with all that after you get, uh, you know, have all your finances figured out, make sure you set enough money back or, or have enough money back for the diesel fuel. Um, you know, diesel fuel is on, on the rise. Uh, here in Ohio, we haven't seen $3 a gallon diesel fuel in quite some time. And it's, a you know, on the Ma and Paul places out in the country off of the interstate is 309 for diesel fuel right now. So I would expect, if I were you, I would expect to, uh, you know, budget in at $4 a gallon as far as your diesel fuel goes for your truck. Um, anyway, brings to another topic. If you're going to start, go ahead and do it now. Okay, that's all I'm going to say about that. Um, you're, you guys aren't going to see a video from me for probably another two weeks as far as me out trucking. Uh, I may do a video as far as me doing something around here at the house. It just depends on what I decide to do. If you didn't catch my live, just to bring you up to speed, uh, I ended up having uh, some surgery done on the side of my face. I had a... Uh, um, I, I hate saying the word, but it, it was cancer. Uh, it, people hear cancer, you know, hear that C word cancer and think the worst. This was, uh, skin cancer. It was from extreme exposure to the sun throughout my lifetime. Uh, the spot has actually, you know, as far as I can remember has been there about six years and it's just grew over time. And it was time to get it removed, get it checked out, figure out what it was and get it removed. So that's what we ended up doing. Um, <laughs> the big thing is on my side was when I went in to have it done, I, you know, in my head, I had thoughts of, okay, I'm going to come out with a, one or two stitches at the most, maybe three. Um, but what ended up happening was they took, uh, such a large amount out of the side of my, uh, face that, uh, it, uh, turned into four inside stitches and 23 outside stitches. I'll give you a quick close up. We just took the stitches out today. It goes from right here all the way down to here, follows right up by my eye and comes down. I had a little spot right here by my eye, uh, my eyebrow. And, uh, that's what, uh, we had to have removed. So anyway, doctor's orders take a few weeks off, you know, if I can, which was the best, uh, that way I don't bump it on anything or irritate it in any which way, shape or form. So that's what I'm doing. 
Um, that's why I've been out. That's why you guys haven't seen uh, any kind of content from me in the past couple weeks other than my live. But uh, that's what's happening. So about another week and a half, two weeks, we'll get some videos out again and get back on the road and do all that good stuff. So I'm going to leave you with that. Um, if you're ready and you're wanting to do it, as far as the hot shot game goes, now is the time to get into it. So hope to see you out on the road. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching. And we'll catch you on the next one.